So we're standing on top of the Jimmy Stewart building looking at our 232 DC kilowatt solar array installed about a year ago, uh, partnering with EI Solutions. Their Kyocera panels generate about 320, 330 kilowatt hours per year, uh, equates to approximately about 1% of our energy use here on the lot. Looking at the payback of solar is very interesting compared to some of the other options we have on the facility. Uh, a lot of things we've been focusing on after installing this is really around energy efficiency based things. They really have paybacks of one or two years. Uh, the payback on this solar array is approximately 10 years. It's really important to have on-site generation in order to state our claim of, of being part of uh, decreasing our carbon emissions and actively taking a role in energy generation. Well, we've experimented and piloted with a, a couple of different alternative energy fuels. We worked on, we used some biodiesel on our Pelham 123 production in New York City. Uh, we also trialed uh, solar generators on angels and demons. Uh, the solar generators right now, the capacity for them don't replace any of the other diesel generators. Um, so we're actually working with the vendors right now to figure out how, what type of solutions and what type, what's the appropriate methods to use these solar generators. So again, it actually replaces some of the previous energy generation resources and it doesn't add to the complexity of the production. We have green production guidelines that uh, has best practices for a lot of our productions to go out there and actively look for green hotels or green vendors, green catering companies. As you can imagine, you can the complexity of going to a variety of locations throughout the, con the country. Sometimes there is um, availability of those type of vendors and sometimes there is not. Um, so we don't have a relationship across the country with people, but on various productions we are very active on sourcing local green resources at each place.